love those girls. Hey folks, we need, we need a happy thing today. So I'm gonna show you our kitty. This is, um, her name is, we named her Sparrow, which is uh, one of the name of cat names. This is not that group picture that I showed you where there were six that came in at one time. Um, the gray one, and then the um, flame point, the lynx point, and then the three, uh, uh, link, uh, wait a minute, no wait, it was, <laughs> I'm going to start over, it was the, the a gray one, and then the lynx point, the flame point, and Oh, a seal point and three lynx point. This one I put down also as a lynx point. So they're kind of kind of blend in sometimes. Yeah, I thought I thought we needed to have a little something happy. And uh, she was hit by a car. It kind of made me a little sad because. She had been with this family since um, late March, and they never got her spayed. And uh, she got got was outside, so she's so little though for being that age. She, she's uh, 18 weeks, and she only weighed 315. So I, I just wonder if they got her, because 315 to me is like uh, a four four months yeah anyhow um, she's gonna go up for surgery tomorrow she probably either has a fractured pelvis or one or two um, um, femur um, broken and I hope it's not the femoral head that's what I'm hoping but she's wonderful and she also does have a open spot now from the uh, injury and I don't like that because those, and, and it is a little infected, but she's on some mighty good antibiotics and soreness meds. And uh, so we'll get, she's going to go up tomorrow. Tomorrow morning is also our um, Humane Ohio, and Jim is one of them that helps us uh, check in. And um, when she goes home, she's pretty close to Brian, so she's going to help um, transport her to Dr. Darcy and um, Darcy's gonna take some x-rays and she'll call me then when the x-rays are done yeah there you go Jim our taxi's ready I gotta go out and get two more carriers too out of our out of our shed one for her and one for another surgery keep your fingers crossed folks we're gonna try and send in seven cats tomorrow for surgery that's pretty high wishing but I would love to be able to do that so we've just have so many females now and in order that we're not here till bedtime on um, this coming Saturday when Dr. Darcy's here we gotta try to get some of those females done so keep your fingers crossed for um, seven for us to go tomorrow yeah I'm gonna try to do seven uh, send seven up to Humane, Ohio, and then she'll be at Dr. Pettigrew's and Brian. I wanted you to see her. She is a living doll. Yeah, isn't she pretty? She's eating real good. I just, I, I just wonder if they had her arrival time a little off because she's so little. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, we were gonna declare it done. <laughs> Oh gosh. All right, kiddo. You ready to go back to bed? I did actually let her down on the floor so she could um, have a little change of pace because we don't like cages, do we? No, I don't even like to say that word cage. Oh, you're so pretty. Yeah, this is where you're gonna be one day. You will be up here. And the, um, we're, we're, uh, we open the door to the back thumpers room and the front thumpers room. So that means all of those cats and kitties that's back there 
now can range from back to front bumpers and to the welcome room. So, and, and they're really starting to spread out a little bit. Those five babies, the two domestic shore hair and the three American shore hair, oh my, they're just zooming all over. And I'm very happy to say that the six group, oops, I know, I know, I just felt that. Let me turn you a little bit different. There you go, you're trying to, here. You're trying to look backwards, kind of twist your body a little, didn't it? There. She says, excuse my back, but I want to see what's going on back here. Um, the six that came in yesterday are are doing really well. They're, well, the gray one's still pretty shy, but the others are coming around. I'm going to go put her back. She's getting a little antsy, and it's hard to hold her without letting her back in slip a little. So keep her in your good thoughts and prayers tomorrow. <laughs> and um, I'll let you guys know as soon as I know something. Come on, little feral girl. Little feral, you're so sweet. We just love you so much.